One. Hey y'all, it's Krista. So um, I've got spring on my mind and um, so I'm gonna do a Dutch pour and I'm using a bunch of leftover paints and I just watered them down and um, I'll let you know what I'm using uh, while I'm putting them down. But for my split canvas, I'm using Amsterdam Sky Blue Light and Amsterdam's Light Rose. So I've got it already ready to go. So I've got an Amsterdam Permanent Blue Violet. I'm gonna put that down first. These are just a bunch of leftover paints that I had. And then this is a cobalt blue um, that I put, that I mixed with the Art Alchemy Magical Pond. So it's got a little bit of shimmer shimmer in here. And I just made a mess, it's so watery. I'm making a mess already, I never make a mess. I'm losing my mind. Okay, and then I'm going to use uh, Amsterdam's Bronze. We'll just put that right on top. And then I have Amsterdam's Turquoise Blue. Okay, so I'll set all those aside, set these paints aside. I think I'm gonna set Leonardo aside because I don't want him to get paint on him. Put him over here. And I'm gonna pick the dog hair out of my dog hairs, apparently, out of my base color. And right here, there's another dog hair. Okay, now I'm gonna flood my sides, put that over here. So I've got something that I can pour over this, or blow over. Okay, put that up here. And then I'll do this side. Okay, let's set that up here. All right, let's blow this out. Let's go. That is crazy. It is, I think I made my paints too thin, if that's even a possible thing. I'm gonna fix this, my big blowout. Trying to make them thin like Rinska does. I don't 
want that really to be sharp right there, so I'm going to blot that out. And we're going to fix that. I'm just going to scrape that off. Okay. We'll get that pink back over here. Cover that up. Instead of having my blow dryer be all crazy, I'm going to just blow it manually. Okay, a lot of pink. See a goob in my paint. A goober goober. I got it. There's another one. Okay, what do I want to do to this? Do I want to leave it alone? you always say, should I leave it alone? And then you touch it, right? I'm thinking I want to torch it see what pops out because I don't really see much of the bronze popping out I'm thinking I need to go right in here down a little bit. Bring this down. I'm just going to play now. And fix this. And bring this around. never hurts to play with your paints. Just gives it new interest, right? Let's swirl this again. Bring this up up here. Pull this up into here somehow. I think we're going to call this done. All right, let me take my gloves off. And I'll bring y'all down for a close-up. All right, y'all. This 
see what happens when you play with the paint. Just gives it new interest. Transparency right here is so awesome. It is up here too. Let me get up here. Right in here is really cool. I got some cells popping up. It's very springy. It reminds me of like irises and uh, the little bluebells that come up in Texas. Right here is that cobalt mixed with the uh, art alchemies. This is cool right here. Look at all those layers you can see. Then we come up here. See this little explosion up here? And I love the bright, bold colors right in here. Got my little cells popping out. All right, y'all. This was a quick one. But it was fun. That's cool right there. And I hope Puxatani Phil was wrong. I hope spring is here soon. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye, y'all.